Welcome back to Views of a Flick. I'm Will I Am Defoe, aka Big Willie Style. That said, what's happening? It's Ron Jarobi. Ron Jarobi, you already know me. And we back for Deadpool and Wolverine, Deadpool 3, starring Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman, of course. Uh, directed by Sean Levy, written by Ryan Reynolds and Rhett Reese. We all know that this all Ryan Reynolds' baby, pretty much. That makes sense. I didn't know it was written. I didn't know he wrote this. In which I wonder I wonder how much of the normal MCU process was involved in this movie. Which we all know this was the first I'm rated gonna be R. Honest with you. This was the first rated R MCU Marvel movie. I'm gonna be honest with you. Now that you say that, I understand what the feeling I get when I watch it now. Cause this, yeah, it is rated all, but to me, it's Disneyfied. It's Disneyfied rated all. Despite some of the shit that happened, it just seemed like it was too light to be so dark. Like it was dark, but I wanted it to be a darker. You literally wanted it to be darker. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why it was just. I don't know. Maybe too it was, much. It was too much sunlight. So no, I watched. I watched the first two Deadpool's yesterday. One and two. Yeah. Not yesterday. Day before yesterday. Mm. And uh, maybe it was a different lens yeah, they shot the, the movie no, with. It's just the shade. Yeah. Something different. Yeah, some some was different. Like it just wasn't like I don't know. It just felt like a like a high dark comedy would be, but not a dark. Dude literally wanted the movie to be a darker shade. No, no, not the shade. I I felt like the the feeling of it. Don't get me wrong. The movie was good. Yeah. It just was different. I could just tell something was different about the the past two. Mm-hmm. And now you say he wrote it. It's more like, cause to me, at the like at the end of the movie. Well, I mean, what he wrote, it, him and Sean Levy was the team behind all all of. But the I could just the tell that this this felt like, uh, even though yeah, this felt like a Ryan, like only Ryan Ryan Reynolds could have did this movie. Oh yeah, all I think to me, all of the Deadpool's are like that. I feel and, like, but but I feel like in the you, other ones, in which we all know that he like fought for the Deadpool's to be made after what happened in. What was that, the Wolverine? Yeah. Yeah. At the end, I, d- I determined this was, to me, was a dark rom-com. Because of how it ended. And that's what made me, that's what really made me like the movie. Well, mm-hmm. not, that wasn't the only reason, but that's what made me fuck with the movie hard. Because I'm like, he did all this, out of, just bec- well, not all this, but you know what I'm saying? The beginning of the movie, you know what I'm saying? He was having problems with Marina. Yeah. And... It just seemed like he went through all this shit just to just to realize like that's who I that's who I care about. I'm gonna do this for her type shit. And I'm like, damn, this straight was a rom com. All of them like that though. Yeah. Think so? Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Everything. This, but this one seemed like it was. I don't know. It just was. I mean, like literally I the first one he was doing it for her <laughs> to get her back. Yeah, 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 yeah. But <clears throat> they didn't feel like rom coms to me though. Those movies. This I one felt it. like a rom com to me. That's what I'm getting at. Don't y'all know how the how all the rom the, all the good rom coms got that that it just it's it's a something that it got. I don't know if it's the know. shot the way it's shot like as far as the camera or what, but it's like Disneyfied, like happy go lucky. I don't know what I'm trying to say. I don't yeah, know. I don't know. I didn't, I got get, lack that, of I didn't get that from this movie at all. Dude, what about you, Sid? What you think of De- Deadpool and Wolverine? <clears throat> um. <clears throat> I, I thought it was the best Deadpool movie. Yeah, of course. Um, by far, I, I can say by far. I am. Um, I I enjoyed it a whole lot, and surprisingly enough, I enjoyed the comedy more than I did the action. So, yeah, I think I think I would agree with that. I think I would agree with that. What you done? Maybe yeah. that's what I meant. Like it when I, it was less. It was like more comedic than it was action. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me watching this when the movie went off, I thought that this was the perfect Deadpool movie. Mm. Like if you a fan of Deadpool, whether that be in the comics, whether you got fans of Deadpool, where you be, whether you became a fan of Deadpool. From the first two movies, from the or from the video game, 
this would be the perfect Deadpool movie Which that game? you he would want. Any game he be in? Nah, he uh he had a video game. Oh damn, did he? Yeah. I know he was in uh, X Men Legends or one of them or something like that, but no, I think he had like one old like was it, what was say early two thousand maybe oh, okay. like on PlayStation or some shit. Okay, or maybe like PlayStation Two or something. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Yeah, but, but do feel like he was a little bit more embraced as for character in the, in the writing with like you know what I'm saying. He was a little fleshed out. I mean, not embraced, but he was a little. Yeah, yeah, and from. And it's kind of wild that now that we into a Deadpool trilogy, now that they have fleshed out, like we know Deadpool and Ryan Reynolds, well, not version of, he's only Deadpool. We know like who this Deadpool is. Mm-hmm. From from the beginning, <clears throat> from when that nigga couldn't speak a word, <laughs> to his right. mouth being sold up. In fact, shout out to baby Deadpool. Which... I, that, that was a question I had because I thought about that when they showed the flashback. Remember when his mouth was sold up? Mm. How come that didn't like heal or something? If he got accelerating healing. I mean, the question is why could we see his mouth, period. But it's on another subject. Are you talking about the old? Yeah. I'm talking about when he like had... Like we shouldn't have been able to... Hold on, what you talking about? It was, remember he had his mask off at one point. Hold on, when when you talking about? Uh, what ex- you talking on about? The old, the old dead pool. I mean, the old the first X-Men, one? what was that? What was Wolverine. The first one? Yeah, the Wolverine. Yeah, Wolverine. <clears throat> yeah, he didn't have no suit on. That's what I meant. That's like, what I'm we saying. We shouldn't have been able to see him at all. Yeah. <laughs> but he was just being created. I mean. They so, made his face look like the, the mask. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they did, which is crazy. But this mm. movie, I thought I thought it was funny. I laughed throughout the movie. Mm-hmm. It was stuff that I like. Laugh probably longer than I should have at small shit. <laughs> I look. You said the action was better than the. I mean, the comedy was better than the action, mm-hmm. but I enjoyed the action also. I did too. It's maybe one. Not that it was better, but that it was just in the forefront. It was. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. it was just the comedy throughout the movie, and I would say maybe. What it was maybe what, five six fight scenes in this movie. Yeah, it was like a, it, but it was a hidden com, it was hidden comedic beats, like it was. Yeah, yeah, that, that's why I'm saying, saying it was you, comedy it, throughout the yeah. entire movie. Yeah, so I understand that the comedy was in the forefront, but outside of one fighting scene, I enjoyed all of the fights. <laughs> I wonder which fighting scene you talk about. Oh, I tell you, it was the group fighting scene with all of them, with everybody at the end. Yeah, <laughs> with all the Deadpool's. No. No, with, I the cameo. Was, they was with the group, yeah, with, with all the cameras. Gam- I mean, this, is, this is a uh, so, this is a spoiler review, so it don't even matter. Yeah. Once they introduced yeah, Blade and and um, pretty much every leak that they yeah. said happened happened. I ain't know about that. No, no, not every leak. Shit, I, well, I, I it heard was about, something that something that I was wrong. I heard about Blade. I heard about Electra. I heard about Gambit. Yeah, but, yeah I ain't heard about true. none of them. I don't see how much you be on. <laughs> you be in the know. But yeah, yeah but it was. I seen articles saying that it's just rumored casting. Yeah, but it was that fight scene that yeah. I just like. I don't know. It was just something about the way they shot it. It was just I really wasn't messing with it. But I couldn't take my eyes off of Gambit, <laughs> even though Gambit looks stupid as fuck. Yeah, I was gonna say that. Like, uh, that's that's one of my. I don't have a lot of gripes, yeah. but that was one of them. Yeah. When you say he looks stupid, it's his costume. Yeah, to her. But I think they did that on purpose. Yeah, though. I think they, right. they Me did too. that on like, purpose. Because I think it's a couple things that I think they did on purpose just to, like, you stupid ass fans. Galvanize galvanizer. Yeah, galvanizer me. Yeah. Like, like y'all want to y'all wanna hype accurate Wolverine? Here you go. Man. Nigga look dumb as hell. It was short. Being yeah. short. <laughs> nigga was 5'2". <five>, <laughs> but Wolverine ain't that hell. short, though. That was the like nigga a like five two five four. That was like four. a little person. That was like Peter Dinklage height, wasn't it? Nigga, the regular Wolverine is like five two five Peter four. Peter Dinklage is a, is a little person. Nigga, that nigga, how tall do you think five two five four is? Five four. That's not a little person height. But I don't think he five four. He though. looked. He looked little person. He looked like. But he, he only looked person. like that because of CGI though. <laughs> I thought they was dude was silly as hell. Man, yeah. he was out of pocket for that one. He looked like Johnny Bravo <laughs> with black hair. And did people say you want a comic accurate gambit in the suit? 
That like, he just guy. looked ridiculous. It looked, his suit looked too metallic. Yeah. And what's his name again? Uh, Channing Tatum. He just too big now. Like, yeah, the nigga was, was big That's as, what I thought the problem with him was. was. big he was, as hell. He was like, brolic as hell. I'm like, I think they did this on purpose. Nah, I think he just gained some weight. No, nah, he and always nah, been kind of face, Nigga face look fat as hell. But I mean, like. He said, I'm going to make a name for myself. <laughs> if then, when he started talking, at first, I didn't even think he had a Cajun accent. <laughs> like, I'm like, did they give this nigga a different language or something? I think they was making fun of making fun of him. I don't think they was really. Yeah, no, nah, they was. They was making fun of Channing. <laughs> they would for a fact. <laughs> I don't they know. Was, I never understood why people wanted Channing Tatum to play play him. I never got that out of him. Maybe that's how Channing Tatum felt too. He probably was, like, let's was t- for let's it. Show. That's probably why Ryan Reynolds did this shit. He's like, oh, you want to do this shit? Yeah, it was a bunch of inside jokes with the whole Gambit situation. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. But shoot, the theater clap when they showed uh, Wesley Snipes. Yeah, my theater did came too. Out Even there. though it was only like six of us in there, my theater yeah, did really? too. Yeah, no. I went there at 11.30 though, no. in the morning. Um, Senior citizen time. Uh, you you brought up Wesley Snipes. Uh, yeah. Looking m- silly as hell. Man. <laughs> I think you look silly. He just he just skinny to me now. Like oh, yeah. Wesley he, just he, skinny he like old, old man now. Like, yeah, but that's how, yeah. that's how old man Blake should look for real if you think about it. Man, did you peep the, the shot he took at Marvel with it though? Oh yeah, yeah. What did he say? Said I'm it the only, only blade. Oh only yeah, 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 one yeah. Blade. I'm peep, the only blade. I thought that was saying like <laughs> you go, Marshall better go and pack it up. <laughs> my Just my that and yeah. the yeah. fact that they can't get the movie off the ground. Yeah, yeah. But hey, I'm hey, I'm I'm waiting patient. I don't I don't even like care I no say, more. I don't care as long as if the movie come out and it's good, I ain't gonna care. But, but uh let, let let's rewind it back to the the way the movie came, the move the beginning set the tone for the whole movie. Yeah, it did. Yeah, it did. He the birthday boy? Huh? The no. birthday boy? Oh. Nah. The opening fight. The dancing and stuff. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Did I you... wonder, was that Ryan Reynolds actually doing that? Hell no. Nah. That was a, probably a dance. I wouldn't be surprised if one of these little YouTube, you know, the little YouTube dance that be running around with the outfits on and they be dancing. <laughs> He probably, they probably wouldn't got a dancer to do that. Did y'all, did y'all expect him to pull that skeleton up out of there like that, though? Nah. Nah, I didn't. Nah. I, and didn't. I what, thought he wasn't going to be in there for real, and everybody was going to be mad. Man. And when he broke the rib off the skeleton, did you see the skeleton looking at him like, man, what you doing? <laughs> yeah, they was tripping. I thought the skeleton was going to was gonna, like, gonna start coming back to life or something. Dude, don't the skeleton, skeleton man. <laughs> Marvel could bring anybody back. They got enough money. They gonna offer you enough money, bring you back, <laughs> even in your death. There you go. And I like <laughs> all the meta jokes about Disney. Yeah, this movie seems like it was a good farewell to all that shit. Like <laughs> we ain't bringing this up no more. No more multiverse. It might get mentioned, but nah, all that they, shit they still gotta finish it off. I mean, yeah, yeah. Multiverse ain't gonna be done until we get Secret Wars. But I don't think it's gonna be the main focus, though. Right. Like it has been. I don't think. I think it's gonna be like not in the background, but kind of like in the background, mm. kind of. Like how they look at the Speed Force. Kind of, yeah. But I just think I or just think um, like all the jokes of. Yeah, that, you got to admit, that, that movie was meh. That movie was trash. That movie was trash. Like, you got to, like, dude was straight giving Marvel advice during the movie, which is why I wonder how much, like, Kevin Feige had to do with it. Because it's like, you let the Blade joke go. Man. <laughs> you let you let him, you let dude save the last three, four know. movies why was trash. How, why wouldn't he? And that's the consensus of everybody. Cause that's all the that's like literally the talk going on right now, mm-hmm. like with the people. Like I wouldn't so, be surprised if it was started by Marvel. Like if they planted that out there just just to get it, just for this movie, you know? Nah, nah, hell no. Nah. Well, we ain't never seen them do no shit like that. Not with how they, they been Disney operating. wouldn't do that shit. 
That would have been genius. Hella made the movie hella relevant. Thing, they not genius. <laughs> that's the that's the whole point of Ryan Reynolds <laughs> making fun of them. I'm not talking about Facts. them putting it out there like that. I'm talking about Ryan Reynolds and them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, why would Ryan – how would Ryan Reynolds and them do that? I mean, like, not just them two, but just like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like just like a little small I mean, market but, employee thing. Like, just, But I mean, but they've been switching directors, writers. <laughs> it would be different, <laughs> like, if they – like, if it was just stuff going on behind the scenes, like, we, we can't get the writing down. But these niggas been swapping out. Wiping out groups of writers, and then it's like mean, I, I don't know. The, it was I just, just mean weird. the topic. I just mean the topic. I don't. You know what I'm saying? It was just weird to. Me. That's what I mean by like you got all that going on, and then you let them put that joke in the movie. Like <laughs> the only reason you it was Blake. Happened. Yeah, but I, I don't know. That was just weird to me. But I, to, I, I feel like just niggas just like to look at his comedy. Yeah. Nah, I I think it's because. <laughs> It was rumored that they had a whole script done and was ready to shoot. And when they read the script, they was like, no, nah, man. Like they said, Blade wasn't even the main character in the movie. Mm-hmm. Which is crazy. Which is crazy. So they scrapped everything Who and been the main fired everybody. I don't even want to get into it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't you know, even want to get into it. I mean, you can just say who it is. It. We ain't got to get into it. It was who? women. That's not getting into it. I, I... No, they literally said... Blade, not it. The, I mean, who it was, was the characters though? Was they? They, they didn't. Like, they didn't get to the characters. They just said Blade wasn't even the main characters in his own movie. It was four women or something like that. That's what I was like. But since we own Blade and all of the side characters, they will lead to one of the gripes that I have in the movie. What's that? I don't think the movie took the time enough to explain like why these people was here. And how these people got here. I know they said it in a brush over comment, mm. but it's like, I don't know. Give us a little bit more. Like, cause like why, why them? Like, why are they the only ones that's here? Like, if the other Fantastic Four dead, are they there? No. Is it like, why did the TVA only get Johnny and Electra? Yeah. And not Daredevil. I, yeah. I get what you're saying. Outside of outside Blade, the only of one made sense in this not, scene. Yeah, but see, it's she said Daredevil was dead. Yeah. You're saying why they didn't get one from another universe? See, yeah, they said Daredevil was dead, but I believe the only reason they got Elektra was because we know Ben Affleck not about to sign with. They couldn't get Ben Affleck to sign with Disney to do that. So what you want? Plus, to he explain too big to be playing Daredevil now. You yeah. want him to explain why he wasn't around? No, no. I was just saying that um, I I would have liked for them to give a little bit more of why they was there and how they got there. Like, what made the are is the universe is gone? Yeah, yeah. They are. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. They said. Um, in so many words, they said basically they plucked them from their universe, like yeah. they did Deadpool, because their universe. I don't know if it was gone in that moment, but it was dying mm. like Deadpool. Was they all was. the uh, what they See, call what they, they call them special, them. them special? What they call them people? No, nah, they weren't anchors. They weren't anchors. No, nah. no, nah, because in this movie, Wolverine is the anchor in every universe. Shit, basically they said Wolverine the anchor in the whole. Fox universe. Yeah. Yeah. And which I do I do kind of like That's that they strange. took the whole molecule man concept and turned it into this whole anchor concept. I do hope we get the molecule man at some point in the MCU. Which I mean we probably not because he like just too OP. I don't know but who the hell that is. Dude can literally like do everything. Yeah, like he can just create shit just out of nothing, like like he manipulates molecules, yeah. Which I say, and alchemy. if he dies, like he literally <clears throat> blow up like the entire universe. Well, that's not alchemy. So, um, I'm hoping they don't make Wolverine the focal point moving forward because I think it'll ruin it for everybody else again. I think he will be up until Secret Wars, and then after that, what will ruin it? 
I think as long as it's Hugh Wolverine Jackman, mascot. I think as long as it's Hugh Jackman, I think he will be. And what you mean by the forefront and what? I feel like we like he was with, with, with the, the X-Men movies. See, I don't think he will be that because I don't think he gonna be the full. I don't think he gonna be around. That's, yeah, with that's the what I was saying. Yeah, I, think I don't he, think he gonna be around. He, to with me, that. he always been the mascot. Nineties cartoon, all this shit. I think that's why he was the mascot in the movies. But okay. he wasn't the mascot in the movies. That's what we can go ahead with. I don't want to say. He was a nigga that he was basically looked at as the leader, and he yeah, was he was the leader. In the movie, that ain't the mascot. He was the mascot to me, <laughs> and it, it it turned to me. It made X Men one dimensional. Oh, that's great way to look it was up. all focused around Wolverine, which I understand at the time, you know, because he was such a popular character. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. Ryan Reynolds said, "You are, are X Men." You know what I'm saying? Thanks. But I used to call him X Man before I knew his name was Wolverine. But um, like no bullshit when I was little. It just it it, it y'all know I'm not a fan of the X Men movies. So, but I thought in this movie, see to me it was times it was literally times in this movie where I was like, with Ryan Reynolds, shut the fuck up, please. Yeah, was, that's why I say it's a lot. It was a lot different. He was, he was, he took, he took that, he was talking, I feel like he talked to us more than he had lines in the movie. That nigga was just talking a lot. Yeah. <laughs> like, he was just that's talking. Why that's Deadpool. Exactly. That's why everybody kept telling him, man, shut the fuck exactly. up. Exactly. <laughs> and which is what I would say about Hugh Jackman. He was a good breath of fresh air, I guess I yeah. could say. Mm-hmm. Like, Supporting every time, Ryan. like, he was talking and doing what, doing what, what he do with Wolverine. Because it was like, we got a break from this nigga. He said, right. he said. I can speak now. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how I felt. And maybe that's how they wanted the audience to feel. Yeah. Like, yeah, I feel like, this, like they wanted yeah. us to be like, Deadpool, shut the hell up. Because that's so how I felt in the movie. Like, that's how I always felt about Deadpool. Really? Yeah, he always just do too. He just do a lot. He just remind me how, yeah. See, I always felt like the char- other characters felt that way. But I guess I've never felt like that, like with him in the movie. In a movie or whatever he was on. Nah, I think that was intentional for yeah. everybody to feel like, yeah. man, would he shut the fuck up? Facts, <laughs> facts, facts. What was it that he said that made Blaze say retarded? <laughs> man, he said you retired. He said retired. Yeah, didn't something like no, that. No, yeah, he said I thought you re. I thought you retired. <laughs> then dude said retarded. Retarded. <laughs> <laughs> retarded. <laughs> hey. No, it was, like I said, it was moments that had me crying, literally a crying. Patch man, he's looking crazy. <laughs> I fuck with this blade though. For this, Wesley is so small now. <laughs> yeah, man. And yeah, they say you shrink as you get older. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. And this nigga want to do a movie. Talk about I can still be Blade. I mean, he had to have a mentor. That's probably. He, I mean, he had to have like little people he training though. He could do it like that. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's possible. That probably was I guess it's possible now. We could get a Mahershala Wesley meetup in Secret Wars, maybe. It's possible now. So. What was your dislikes about this movie? Yeah, I was just about to get into that. Uh, He said one. Uh, I feel like... Deadpool was just saying a lot of people just babbling the whole movie. Uh, I didn't, I didn't like, I didn't care for the Deadpool fight at the end. I, I agree with that. Oh, uh, that, that was underwhelming. Yeah, yeah, I ain't really care for that. Uh, yeah, that, that wasn't. Uh, I'm trying to remember it. Remember, make sure I'm remembering it all. But speaking on the Deadpool fight, why you thinking of it? I wish they would have showed us who the Lady Deadpool was. Yeah, they didn't show us, did they? No. Nah. For some reason, I got uh, what's the g- people that own the hotel? Paris the Hilton. Hotel. Yeah, I don't know why I got Paris Hilton. Probably the ponytail. Everybody, of course, was 
well, it's been rumored and everybody speculate that it was his wife, Blake Lively. <laughs> Did you peep on that scene? I where he was, he was like, I'm telling Blake. Blake. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> no, hey, that, I didn't know who she. Was. I forgot. I didn't know he was married to Blake Lively. Yeah, yeah they they just said they uh got a, got their fourth child. Yeah. Man, that dude said, I'm telling Blake. Did y'all think that was going to have somebody kill the baby uh, baby dead fool? Nah. I thought that was going to be ignorant. But I will say about them, in the at first, I was like, wait, so none of them can regenerate. <laughs> it was just that one. <laughs> yeah. Man. I was like, cool. Did he kill on purpose for his gun? <laughs> this shit was hell of a I knew he was going to kill him. Yeah, he was doing too Oh, yeah. Hell yeah, nice pool. Shout out to nice pool. Nice pool. Yeah, that's his name. Yeah, nice he looked like a the Game of Thrones character a little bit. Or was it a samurai he was trying to look like? He kind of like a, he kind of looked like. A Game a- of am Thrones. I tripping or did they not give him a suit upgrade at the end of the movie? Did his did his suit change at the end of the movie? Who nice pool? No. Nah, was- Cause I don't remember it Did being that. I don't remember it being that shiny. Yeah, at it the was beginning. shiny when he first ran yeah. up. Mm. It like it was made out of plastic or something. Oh, okay, <laughs> I I didn't think it looked like that at the beginning. Is he like futuristic? Nah, nah. I I think he I think he like a cosplayer. I, pretty much. Cause like nigga, what can you do? We yeah, didn't I see was him wondering. do nothing. He didn't do nothing. He just had them guns. <laughs> Yeah, that's yeah. funny as hell. Yeah, but I am I enjoyed it. Like you said, I, I would say that that fight was underwhelming. Another thing that I would a gripe that I would say, I is just that, didn't see. I'm, my bad, to cut you. I just ahead. didn't see the point of it. If y'all was just going, as soon as this Pete nigga come, everybody cool. Like who was this Pete dude anyway? I know he, he everybody all they got friend. a Pete. Y'all, they friend. Everybody got a Pete pool. Has Pete been in this uh, trilogy? He yeah. was. In, Wait, no, he was in the second one. Is the second one? Yeah. Was that the second one or the first one? The domino was in. The second one. Was that the second one? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was the second one. Was you talking about Zazie? Yeah. Oh yeah, that was the second one. Damn, damn, I don't remember. Like I, I, I didn't finish part two. Yeah, he was part of X Force. Yeah, all of them him got and, one. Him and him, him. Oh, Pete. so he actually could fight? No. no. Oh, he just in the X Force. It, it was just him, <laughs> Pete, and uh. Domino that survived coming out yeah, that plane. I'm about to say, so you really haven't seen the end. Oh, the second one? <laughs> yeah. No, no, I have saw it, but I just, when I rewatched it the other day, I kind of just was like, all right, yeah. I'm ready I'm about for the to second say, They wasn't X-Force for too long. <laughs> no, I remember that. I remember that. But they brought old boy soon, back. Mm-hmm. Remember, as soon as they started assembling it, they, they all started dying. Yeah. Cause <laughs> it, but then at the end of the movie, a couple of them. Yeah. Uh, like, you went and saved a couple of them, which is how Pete still around. Shit, man. One thing I wish they would have included in this movie, I wish we'd have got a Wolverine flashback or something. Even if you yeah. didn't, I'm not saying you had to have of the one that we we they, look, that we lived with the whole movie. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm not saying oh. that we'd have, we could have got a. I wish we'd got a glimpse of the X Men or some mm. villains or something, and it didn't have to be. They didn't have to have headshots or anything. Just in the background or something. Just give us a glimpse of some of what happened. I wish they'd have uh, fleshed that out a little bit Which more. Which universe yeah, is that Wolverine? We didn't get none of the old. We don't know. We didn't get none of the old X-Men. Remember that cartoon? X-Men? That, that Wolverine that cartoon? Wolverine and the X-Men? Mm. I wonder is it that one? Because he, he by himself, they was all dead in that one too. Well, in that one, that's because they wasn't dead. They just disbanded. I mean, they, they, they ended up dying though. Then it's no, they had just disbanded. Oh, okay. they, was trying, they didn't finish it. Okay. They was trying to find Charles. So, see, I wanted them to flesh the Wolverine that we had out a little bit more, so we can know his backstory. I mean, because we know that Wolverine backstory. We watched. We, no, I'm I talking know, about the I one know we you had. Didn't like, oh, I thought you were talking about the old one that died. No, I'm talking about the one we had the, oh, okay. with the actual yellow suit on. Oh, okay, that's why yeah. I said I wish we'd have got yeah, a flashback of that one. Yeah, yeah, because like I wanted, I wanted, because I feel like he was saying when he said that he killed. Some bad people and a couple good people. Right. I feel like he killed like uh, it, some heroes. Man, it could have been a damn good setup for uh, Avengers versus X Men. Yeah, it could have. Yeah, it could with have. With a flashback, and with you could have just had shit. You already had Chris Evans. Mm-hmm. 
uh, maybe that's what Avengers vs. X Men gonna be. Is it? That him in him in back in his universe, a flash back into his life. Because maybe when he said that the humans, because I was wondering, I'm like, how the humans kill all them? Maybe the humans that he talking about. Because he definitely the said, Avengers. fuck the Avengers. Yeah, facts. So he don't like them. So, like you said, yeah, I agree with you. We sh- I wish we could have got a little bit more of yeah. that just to know what happened. But maybe we didn't because maybe we gone. Because I guess it would be kind of stupid. Like, if you're going to announce Hugh Jackman, well, not even announce, like, bring him back, why not give us another movie well. plus the cameos before the yeah, end of the sequel? told him they must got some plans because he kept saying, nigga, you won't be here till you mind <laughs> Nah. I mean, you might as well before Secret Wars get a movie out of it. Okay, I can admit. I like this Wolverine. Exactly. It was good. I, I, I like this Wolverine. Because he was like the Wolverine? Yeah. And the costume, you know, I, I like this Wolverine. I, I can admit that. More than that. The rage, the way he fought, the first fight between him and Deadpool, the yeah. way he ran up to him. Disney. I had never seen De- when, when Wolverine move Disney like that. Lens, that was that Disney lens on it. But, no, when I say seen him move like that, I mean, like, it's like Wolverine should move. Right. Like the other, like the other, like Wolverine in the Fox X Men, like he just moved like a nigga with claws. Yeah, <laughs> like he just moved like a nigga would with claws. Like and he jumped high. I ain't never seen Wolverine move fast and like really. He like it's like Hugh Jackman don't know a lick of nothing. Like no fighting, no nothing, none of that. Oh yeah, yeah, he probably, yeah. What y'all think of the man? I didn't know he was Australian. It was cool. I went mad at it. So his eyes being white, that's in the mask? Yeah, it, it, it threw yeah. me off a little bit. Yeah. But I get it because Deadpool's like this. So mm. I get it. Now, moving forward, I wouldn't want to see him in the MCU with the... With but the, ain't his eyes white? Ain't, ain't Wolverine eyes white? Yeah. yeah. See, and I think, that's oh, a, I think that was mask, another man. thing that they were just playing with fans. I don't think he's... <laughs> like people be saying they be wanting stuff. Yeah, they be wanting Batman eyes white. They be wanting uh, Wolverine with the helmet. Cause me, I liked it with helmet. I mean, the with, mask. With the oh. mask. I like the mask. The yeah, I liked it, but the nigga looks stupid as hell. <laughs> <laughs> he just don't look like it. Don't look like you in it. You know he, what? He, he it like don't he, look like you should have it on. He look like he aged, yes, he aged about five years. I think. I, I, I here's the thing. I'm gonna give you two examples. We was wondering how they were going to do Captain America's suit. Mm -hmm. Then when they did the comic book version of it in the first Avengers, we was like, nah, that ain't it. But then they went back to what they did in the first Captain. It made more tactical. Mm -hmm. I think they can do the Wolverine costume better if they, you know what I'm saying? Stop. Like I said, I get what you're saying. Them trying to actually make it same thing with Gambit. Mm -hmm. You're trying to make it comic book accurate because yeah. Cap in the MCU ain't comic book accurate. Nah, you know what I'm saying? No. Nah, not outside of that suit. Right. So it got potential. Oh yeah, yeah. It's just in this one he just looked when the mask came on, it looked he looked like he turned into a cosplayer. Cosplayer player. Like it was like, all right. <laughs> when he did this, yeah, he really looked like that boy needs us. But yeah, yeah. That was that, that was another thing. I was like, all right, you ain't got to do that every time. Like that's just your fighting stance that you get into. Huh? <laughs> but that is like it's like, all right, what's up? Yeah, true, true. That's true. That. <laughs> I enjoyed the fighting scene with with them two in the car. Nah, he could have did like this and squatted, made them claws yeah. come out. Yeah, he did like that. I think they'd erupted. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It was a couple times that my theater erupted. Um, with Blade, mm-hmm. um, they wrote it with, of course, with Chris Evans. Come, came. Mm. All right. So when they showed him, well, before, but, but before they revealed who it was, who did y'all think it was? Cap. I didn't think it was Cap. I thought it was, uh, and if it was Cap, I'm like, that's Cap before he get the suit. But I had a feeling it was gonna be Johnny Blaze. Yeah, I, 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 I had a feeling because was it was like rumored Johnny before Blaze. the movie, but. I, when they showed him, I thought it was going to be Cap, but it wasn't going to be Chris Evans. 
I didn't know who it was going to be, but I didn't think it was going to be should, <laughs> They should have picked old boy who they had do um, Reed Richards. Because, you know, he went up for the Captain America role, right? That would have been yeah. funny as hell. Yeah, it would have. Uh, John Krasinski. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> and they just kept. <laughs> no, nah, people would have been like, no, nah, Disney do not like John for some reason. Because if they had to kill him off the way. Another gripe in the movie. I don't mind them killing off Johnny as quick as they did. I don't like the way that they killed him off. I don't, I don't nah. You heard you snapping his skin off like that? Oh, no, nah, he didn't die. I, I, I completely forgot about that part, him, her snapping his skin off. Yeah, I'm about to say, but, that was dope. You don't like how he made him fall out the sky? Yeah, I ain't, I ain't like goofy that. Goofy like that? Yeah, yeah, like, no, nah, he wouldn't be able to do that to Johnny. Like, no. Nah. Out the sky. When, when Pyro, uh, Pyro, like, took the fire from him, like, no, nah, uh, that wouldn't be able to happen. And Disney? I can see that. I can see him pulling the blind. I, just, I don't see him dying from that fall. But I, no, nah, I mean, he wouldn't have died, but he wouldn't have been able to take the fire from him for him to fall like that. Hell no. Why not? He would manipulate fire. Johnny too powerful for this nigga. Oh. No. And that's my thing, Disney. If this is what you're all about to do with these niggas. I think they were just making fun. Do not, I think everybody in, not, this, but, in this movie... If, if they was a period doofy, I think it was intentional. Like that. yeah, it. it yeah. I'm just, I I'm think just it's because don't they. I think it's because they were actually Fox characters. Yeah, that they did goofy. a lot of the goofy stuff that they did. But um, yeah, I do know why they didn't show Blade in the end credits, right? I ain't peep that because mm-hmm. he's not a Fox character. He was New Line. Did they not show Blade in uh-uh. the credits? Mm-mm. Damn. They showed everybody but Blade. Oh, you mean at the Man. end of the, the little montage the at the end? Yeah. yeah. Oh, they they didn't show Blade. Uh uh-uh. uh. Which that was nice to see. I like that. Cause he he new line. He yeah. wasn't Fox. New line cinema. Dang, that wasn't damn. I guess that wasn't Fox. Yeah. Hmm. But um, you I put that Cassandra. out there for the people who yeah. didn't know. You brought up Cassandra Nova. That, that was a big crazy. highlight in the movie. Fuck. Yeah, that yeah. Crazy. She's crazy in the motherfucker, yeah. boy. Yeah. Putting your hands to touching on a nigga soul and spirit. <laughs> you said, you know she had washed them hands. <laughs> <laughs> See, I like that. That's something that's comic book accurate that it, that did look right in the movie was to me. Was her hand CGI? What you mean? The yeah, I'm long sure. Yeah. yeah the mother's no, I mean, like, not, I mean, before, be, even yeah, outside that. Yeah, yeah, the mother's long as hell. Okay, so her hands like that in the comics then? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, I was like, her hands long I mean, in the motherfucker. I, I don't know if they CGI'd or not. I mean, I, I don't know. I ain't never oh, seen the real woman. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, I'm about to say, just, I don't know. I ain't never seen the real woman. Because it looked but like. Her that, hands are like that in the comics. Her, her hands look just regular. Her nail, her. Her fingernail looked like it was about like yeah I know what you're talking about like almost vampire yeah her hand was long, like her, yeah. was long, her fingers yeah. was long as hell because at first I thought I was tripping because I caught a glimpse of it <laughs> I'm like I know her hands were the longest fuck but but they was yeah but I do like that don't and I might not have liked how quick it happened but I do like the only way that they was able to get back was them like was her like letting them go. Oh, you, like, you ain't like the quick flip? Yeah, I ain't like yeah, how they, quick they, it Yeah, they did flip her for pretty quick. Yeah, even though, like, she came back and her plans had changed when she, she figured out what happened. She told about to try to kill y'all, so don't get up out of here. Facts. But, um, damn, what was I about to say about her? She At first, I thought she was, uh, like... I seen the, the 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 wheelchair roll up, and I thought that was gonna be a Charles variant. I knew it wasn't. But then when they showed her standing there with that trench coat, I'm like, this look like the the one or whatever the one the one they trained on uh, Doctor Strange. Hmm. I'm like, this look like her. Oh yeah. They, they I'm like, damn, is they all the same people? Cause she was on all type of shit. Like, yeah, no, nah, they do look alike. I'm like, damn, white bald bitches. <laughs> uh, but yeah, but now they her they did. I, I don't I don't know if she want to dress like Charles, but they did dress like I don't know. Is that yeah cause, yeah? But they've been mortal enemies since the wound. It's crazy <laughs> to me. Yeah, it was crazy. That's why Charles don't want that smoke. Now he like man, we just chill like we out here chilling. Yeah, I want to finally see like who's more powerful between them two. I'm sure she'll probably win because like she could walk, <laughs> but. 
I don't know. Who knows? But I enjoyed Cassandra in the movie. Uh, I liked how OP she was. Just snapping nigga skin off. Like, she, bro. Uh, sadistic. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, she was. What I did not like is I wish they had told us if she killed the Doctor Strange or a Wong or what. She didn't say which one she killed. Mm-mm. We just, they just insinuated that it might have been strange, but I don't yeah. think she killed strange. She just said an entry level sorcerer. Because so. all of them had them look. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I had a song that was out Would have been nice if it was Ned. I ain't even thinking about Wong. <laughs> you say what? It would have been nice if it was Ned. Ned. She was like, I killed this little fat sorcerer. <laughs> yeah. But she did say entry level, so I don't know. But I assumed that she was just calling him Dr. Strange, like a entry level magi- a magician. Yeah. Which Wolverine, which comic version is that with him missing? The hand with the wild hair. Uh, what's the name of that? But because I know that's the one where he is that Age of Apocalypse. Like, he got a claw. I don't think he so. got one claw. He, but I'm saying the other he go by like other. whipping X or something in them comics. What's I can't remember hand? what the name of off? it is. Yeah, it was just cut off. Yeah, he, he got, got like a metal him? part on it. Yeah. He got like, like an metal, adamantium part. Yeah, on it. cap on it. Yeah. Oh, I know that hurt when he. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. I, it, that was nice that they threw that in there. Yeah. The one with the eye patch? Nah, the one with missing hand. Yeah. It was nice that they threw all of them in there. Yeah. But the little montage that they showed, um, which is a little bit of another gripe that I had that I wish we got a little bit more of them. But I just wanted it. to see that one with the with the eye with the eye patch. That storyline look with him over there doing all that uh oh, yeah, Hitch. Up. Yeah. Yeah, that shit tough. Yeah, people fuck with Hitch. It's like a whole community of Hitch fans out there. Patch. Yeah, Patch, not Hitch. <laughs> uh, but yeah, but I just wish we got a, a just a tad bit more. I, I, it would have just been nice to see like a, a punch being thrown in the Wolverine and um, Hulk fight. And mm. then it would have been nice to see just a little bit more Henry Cavill. The Cavalry. The Cavalry. Didn't he say something about yeah, the, the Cavalry? Yeah, the Cavalry. Did he say something about the Cavalry? Yeah, he called him that. He was like, the Calvary's here. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, that's about it, though. Y'all got any more gripes? No, nah, I, don't, I don't think I got no gripe. Who was the dude at the beginning? Is he from X-Men? So at the birthday party, was it the Asian dude with the red hair? Who he supposed uh, to be? Yeah, he a, he a, he a character. Yeah. He was from X-Force. No, I know he a character, but who is he? I'm, I can I know I know I seen him his face before, but I can think of his name. Some shit. Uh, if, if it ain't nobody special, you ain't gotta look it up. I just nah, I'm like, damn, I can't remember this nigga name. Nah, he ain't nobody special. But <laughs> S is not for special. Mm. But yeah, I I enjoyed the movie. If I had to grade the movie, uh, I would give it a B plus. Uh, like I said, there's a few things that could have been better. In the writing of the movie, um, but and I thought the void could have been like bigger, like it didn't feel like they was in the void after watching Loki. Mm. But I give it a B plus. Same, I'm gonna give it a B plus. Um, you know what? I'm gonna go A minus. I'm gonna go A minus. Um. I was highly entertained with this movie, like from beginning to end. So yeah, I'm gonna go A minus. I'm gonna try to go with A minus well. You said you want A minus? Yeah, I'm gonna try to go with A minus well. Yeah, I, I thought the movie was a uh, hella good. I thought the like I said it reminded me of a rom com that that bumped it up for me because I probably would have gave it no, like rom com with Deadpool. And yeah. So yeah, I I'd say B plus. I say B plus. Yeah, yeah. And I like that. Like it wasn't really like a buddy cop movie like people right. thought it would be. Yeah. Like it was like an adventure around the void. Right. Like mm-hmm. pretty much throughout the movie. Um, and I can go ahead. No, my bad. And I like the fact that they kept it to where Wolverine and Deadpool do not like each other. You think so? No, nah, they don't like each other. Yeah, I think other. at the end they, they was Me, like, at nah, the you end, all right. you all right. Yeah, that was a that was at the end, you know, but man, Wolverine and Deadpool don't get along. I, mean, I think I think they like I think he just annoyed with him. 
Like, <laughs> like he didn't like know I can't everybody. be around this nigga. That nigga annoyed by everybody though. Man, that version of Logan. Wait till you see him with Spider Man. Man, I thought I thought we was gonna get a Spider Man cameo. I didn't know which one. But I thought we was gonna get a Spider Man cameo yeah, after he was cool. doing the little thing in the car. Yeah. I'm like, why would why would he do that? Why right. would he just randomly do that in the car? <laughs> like, but I, I I just knew we was gonna get some Spider Man. Do he cameo. got some Spider Man DNA in him? No, no, no. But yeah, but yeah. I just I just wish like the void the void was like the void in Loki. But right. other than that, I ain't had no problem with the void. I wouldn't mind seeing uh, I'm about to. Uh, Juju about the raw. Who? The the villain from the uh, boy the sound like Remy, didn't he? <laughs> I'm about to say what you say. Her name Juju Mbatha Raw. The girl. Oh, oh, the black woman. Yeah. Oh, I'm just I'm like, like saying what? Uh, <laughs> I wouldn't mind seeing her. Somebody, yeah, somebody, well, other than the Afro lady, which I thought was dead. But. I know that was during the flashback. Cause I was like, this happened. This movie happened before the snap, but that was during that flashback mm-hmm. when he was having the interview with Happy. Mm. <laughs> Should have let him funny. in. Dude was like, "So, is the big guy coming?" Man, dude was like, "Nah, guess we got to pay for that budget." He said he don't do these anymore. Cameos, he said, no <laughs> interviews. <laughs> See, I liked all that. Yeah, like I loved all of that. It like, was a const- it was a constant jab in it. At Fox but still, Marvel even with, with with Chris Evans, he was like, man, he was killing the budget. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, facts. See, I would put this up there with the, with the first Deadpool. It may be a little bit up up it, but this is arguably, I mean, well, not arguably, but tied with. Or the best Deadpool movie. See, I th- I think every Deadpool movie it went it, it escalated. I mean, I think it elevated. In my opinion, nah. Second one, nah. I like the second. Man, one. I like I I don't dislike the second one, but nah. Deadpool one was special. Yeah. First, yeah. That, that first real iteration of Deadpool we got that was special. So yeah, the first. Go, go ahead. ahead. No, nah, go opinion. ahead. And that you know them first ones when you first get that. Comic accurate character, you know, it be special, especially when that highway fight scene like leaked, yep. like the CGI ver- like the the cartoonish looking version of it, like when before they was trying to get the movie made, and then to see it like actualized in the movie the way that it was, nah. And that highway fight scene, that's some of the best superhero fight scenes. Probably, probably if you want to calculate them, like if you want to go through it, like it's probably up there, top ten at least. Probably, if you want to say that. But I enjoy the trilogy. Do y'all think that's gonna be the last Deadpool movie? Not this. Movie. I hadn't even thought about that. Nope. I guess what well, we on Thor five now, so yeah. No reason I don't think is gonna be the last Deadpool movie for one when Marvel see how much money they bring in from this they gonna be like yeah we gotta do this again I think I wanted to ask y'all a question but I don't know maybe that should be a different a different episode maybe because with a couple announcements yeah. and a few <laughs> trailers that's been dropped we can come back on that yeah uh, what was I about to go to? Any last words? I'm just looking up to, to see nah. what it's been made so far. If they even got it on her yet. I do want to say something before we get off. Go I knew I was going to enjoy this movie when they said the critics was... Basically, um, saying how good it wasn't. Man, that shit was crazy. I was surprised to see that, like, because it was leaked, like, in the fan viewings, like, before the movie came out, that, like, people was in the theaters crying about how much they loved the movie. It was standing ovations, applause. But then when the cinema score come out after the critics see it, it's like a 
B minus or C plus. Yep. I'm like, wait, this don't make no sense. Like, <laughs> but niggas just out here hating. Not trying to. I mean, we just gave it a B. <laughs> not trying to be funny, but nah, look at look at. And I don't want to, you know, get into that. But look at what the critics have been given. The last couple MCU movies, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then when we see them, it's like, man. Yeah. So. Yeah. But now on cinema score, Ron, like movies that get like a B minus, C plus, like it's like trash movies. Like the way that they grade movies is like, if you're not in the, in at least a, a minus. Or B plus on there, on there, like you not even like like up there, like you ain't even about to be kaput. Hmm. But that's been our review of Deadpool uh, and Wolverine. I, yeah, and Wolverine. Got to make sure you mention that because it's probably too much Deadpool. It probably should be Wolverine and Deadpool, but. I enjoyed it. I can't wait to see what Hugh Jackman and Ryan Reynolds are in next in the MCU. Uh, let's see if we gonna get Wesley back. <laughs> but maybe Remy, Remy Laveau. Oh, we gonna get Remy back. Hopefully, it ain't. <laughs> no, Channing. I mean like Channing. <laughs> no, hopefully not. Hopefully not. Him and uh, Electra, they can go. They they can go ahead. They can go. But that's been views of a flick. At least Letcher was a little eye candy, a little bit. I mean, if you think Jennifer Garner eye candy now, I mean, not I mean, not like she used to be. But come on, it's wild how X two okay. and old girl look just alike in real life. <clears throat> His girlfriend, but that's it. That's been views of a flick. I'm Will I Am Defoe, aka Big Willie Style. That said, what's happening? That's Ryan Jarobi. Ryan Jarobi, you already know me. I'll see y'all next time. Peace. Who girlfriend? Deadpool Talking about girlfriend. Blake Lively?